Power Rangers in Space, known for its iconic status, stands out among the entire Power Rangers franchise. It combines epic intergalactic battles and intricate storytelling, resulting in memorable characters. As the culmination of the Zordon era, in which Zordon's demise takes place, Power Rangers in Space represents a significant turning point for the show. At the center of this pivotal season is our Red Ranger, Andros. Although a continuation of Power Rangers Turbo, Andros embarks on his personal journey in space alongside the previous team of Turbo Rangers. Together they pursue Dark Spectre, facing both new and old adversaries. Along the way, they create their own legacy, shrouded in secrets and questions surrounding Andros's origin on Co-35. As viewers, we have followed the Earth-centric storyline for so long that exploring the events in space becomes an intriguing topic. In this video, we delve into the mysteries surrounding Andros and his team. Clue number one lies in the four unused Ranger Morphers that Andros hands over to the Turbo Rangers to complete the space team. Why did he hold on to these Morphers if he primarily works alone? Clue number two revolves around Andros's distinct behavior as the Red Ranger, contrasting with previous Red Rangers known for their camaraderie. This discrepancy hints at the possibility of another lost team. The presence of Zane, the Silver Ranger from Co-35, serves as clue number three. Zane's discovery, frozen aboard the ship, raises questions about Andros's secrecy. Why did he keep this information from the rest of the team? The frozen state of Zane triggers memories and emotions, making it crucial to unravel clue number four. Andros's hesitancy to share important details with his team further hinders their connection, hindering the formation of a united and harmonious group. The final clue, clue number five, relates to the battle on Co-35 itself. Flashbacks featuring Andros and Zane depict them as the last survivors of the attack orchestrated by Dark Spectre. The fate of the rest of their team remains unknown, leaving us to speculate on their possible demise. While we may not know the specific colors of this original team, additional insights can be found in the Power Rangers comic books, which provide an alternate universe perspective. In the comic book storyline, Andros's parents perished during the attack, prompting the Power Rangers to take him and others in. These orphans, including Mavi and Oz, eventually grow up to become Power Rangers themselves, forming Andros's original team. However, Darkonda's arrival results in their capture, demise, or banishment, leaving Andros as the lone survivor. Though the comic book narrative contradicts certain aspects of the TV show, such as Andros's familiarity with his fallen teammates and Zane's claim of never seeing female Rangers before, it still offers a plausible explanation for the fate of the original in-space team. Consequently, the exact truth remains a theory, partly explained by the comic books. What are your thoughts on the fate of the original in-space team? Leave a comment below and let us know who you consider the best Red Ranger. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe.